With the passing of 86-year-old Ratan Tata, the top post of chairman at Tata Trust, which holds a 66% stake in Tata Sons, is now vacant. So who will take over the $165 billion Tata Group? Ratan Tata reportedly did not appoint a successor before his death, leaving the decision of who will head Tata Trust to the Board of Trustees. These trusts, particularly the Sir Dorabji Tata Trust and Sir Ratan Tata Trust, are the primary shareholders of Tata Sons, owning nearly 52% of the company. Other trusts together own 14% in Tata Sons, taking the total holding to 66%. Who are the trustees? Among the key individuals on the Board of Trustees is Venu Srinivasan, an industrialist from TVS, Vijay Singh, a former Defence Secretary. Both of them served as Vice Chairman of the Trusts. They have been involved in the governance of Tata Trust since 2018, but their prospects of becoming the Chairman appear limited. Another trustee, Noel Tata, Ratan Tata's half-brother and Chairman of Trend, is widely seen as a leading candidate. He is 67 years old, belongs to the Parsi community, and with more than four decades of experience, is the top contender for the job. Noel Tata's involvement with the Trust began in 2019 when he joined as a trustee of the Sir Ratan Tata Trust, followed by his appointment to the board of the Sir Dorabji Tata Trust in 2022. While Noel is a strong contender, other contenders include Leah Tata, the vice president at the Indian Hotels Company Limited, the group's hospitality arm. Maya Tata, Ratan Tata's niece, is an alumnus of Bayes Business School and the University of Warwick. She started her career at Tata Capital and is slowly rising through the ranks. But the final decision will be made through a consensus among the 13 trustees, including other influential figures like Meli Mystery, a close confidant of Ratan Tata, and Darius Khambata, a senior lawyer who had advised Ratan Tata on succession matters. Ratan Tata's tenure marked the last time an individual held both the roles of chairman of Tata Sons and Tata Trusts. It'll be interesting to see who fills his shoes now. For more informative videos like this, keep watching India Today Newsmo.